Good evening, this is Ken Long at Tortoise Capital with the daily debriefing for October 20th, 20, October 19th, 2016, preparing for October 20th. Market remains in bullish normal, right in the middle of neutral on both the annual and the 10-day look-back periods. No signals in overreaction or channeling. Uh, risk index is still uh, postured for favoring intraday moves. Uh, a handful of channeling and overreactions in the uh, large caps in the extended symbol set. Uh, a 5DD in VXX. Uh, some good setups in the Russell small caps. And then uh, plenty to choose from in the auto framer, including some... Uh, some of our favorite trading vehicles. Here you can see the Dow 30 tactical, lots on the auto frame to choose from. McDonald's at a 5 to 1, um, Cisco at 3 and a third to 1. Big winners today Procter and Gamble and uh, Intel. All right, uh, big losers today, excuse me. Uh, Intel down almost 6%. Uh, that's one that I'm going to be targeting uh, on the basis of uh, overreaction from extreme conditions come extreme results. Uh, the winners today, uh, American Express and Visa at 2% and 1.5% respectively. Uh, inside the ETF tactical Really just a handful of dojis, the, the 5DD and the VIX, a couple 551Ws in Russell, and consumer discretionary. XLV at 3.7 to 1 on the auto framer. Uh, here's all the key stats on the auto framer. And uh, set up opportunities for deep value in the top shelf here in the regression line fractal framework. Uh, McDonald's also showing up here and then in the uh, bottom shelf the red stack those are the ones that are the overheated symbols the ones that are the most numbers of ATRs ahead of their um, RL270 daily squeezes are ones that are uh, uh, prepared for large one-day moves on the basis of comparing their range stat to their uh, range risk t of today. Um, VIX and XIV, top of the list. Uh, Amazon, the S&P, the diamonds, real estate, utilities, uh, the Euro-Asia blend. So um, that's this is a, uh, a posture that the market itself finds itself in. And uh, I'll be looking to exploit uh, indexes on this, uh, on this strategy. Quick look at the market mosaic. Uh, we remain in that sideways chop. Uh, we're right at the long term average uh, of the last 10 years in terms of the slope of the 30. And just some key stats for reference. We're stuck in the bottom of this channel down here, and you can see that the river has rolled over. Uh, the 90 has pulled back to its almost to its long-term average, and that's where the 30 and the 10 are. This is a right smack dab in the middle of the road. Market just waiting for November 5th in elections. And that's everything I want to cover on the daily reports. Just a couple quick ones from the chat room. Here's one on uh, Brazil um, with uh, with Kim Anderson doing a really nice job here with the uh, Z3PO breakout and an orderly exit right at the RLCO. Uh, perfect. Here's one she'd like to get back. Um, didn't take the um, these moves. There was the owl pocket pocket, leaving five R on the table. Um, 
Uh, look, if if the time, will, pattern, and money is not there, then it's not a trade you can't you can take, and you can't uh, beat yourself up about that. Uh, all four of those things have to be in place. Time, there's still time left in the day. Will, you have to be in the right mindset, ready to trade properly as a professional. Pattern, uh, the rules have to be there, and they fired, and your entry signals are uh, taken. Time will pattern and money, and you have to be capitalized to where you can take the trade. If one of those elements is not there, then it's not a trade that you can take, and so you can't, after the fact, go back and beat yourself up for the mind state you were in at the time. Now, you can look at it as a data point, and you can study and, uh, and update your estimate of what's reasonably available in some of these symbols, but you can't um, beat yourself up. Uh, any further on that. It's not fair. Trading's hard enough. Don't make it harder. Um, and so, uh, r really, the stop and reverse here on the dragon collapse is also an opportunity to get this downside, and then you get the owl reversal. And XME uh, is, uh, for this very reason, is uh, one of the reasons it's a, a favored intraday trading vehicle. It's nice on swing trades, but it's also powerful on the intraday. Um, it takes a lot of emotional courage to, you know, mark up your charts and be critical about yourself and then share that with others. So that's the kind of emotional resilience uh, I think Kim has and why she's such an outstanding trader and uh, success um, is there for her. So this is uh, Ken Long, a Tortoise Capital. Keep your wrist measured and your powder dry. Um, take care of yourselves. Treat yourself gently. Don't be harder than you need to be. Work hard, um, but let it be what it is. Take good care, and we'll see you in the chat room.